Hi, and welcome back to Cut the Crackle. Next month, an amazing 67 uniquely designed sculptures will be appearing on the streets of Bristol to help raise money for Bristol's Children's Hospital. The event is called Gromit Unleashed 2 and is being organised by the charity Wallace and Gromit's Grand Appeal, which has been working to support the hospital since 1995. The first sculptor to be unveiled for this event is Kraken Build Gromit, a giant brick-built model of Wallace's long-suffering canine chum himself. Made from a staggering 30,456 pieces, the sculpture was engineered by the LEGO group themselves and took a team of expert model builders over 120 hours to construct. Kraken Bill Gromit, along with the other 66 sculptures, will be on display from July 2nd to September 2nd, and at the end will be auctioned off to raise money for the Grand Appeal to help support Bristol Children's Hospital, which treats more than 100,000 sick children every year. If you're unable to attend Gromit Unleashed, you could always help support the cause by visiting their Grand Appeal shop online. It's full of fun gifts and all the proceeds help support the Bristol Children's Hospital. I'll put a link in the pinned comment below. I've been a fan of Wallace and Gromit ever since I was little and I must admit I have considered submitting my own project to LEGO Ideas for ages. The only thing that keeps putting me off is that I believe in order to do the characters justice you'd need to make a completely new mold for Gromit and then new head molds similar to LEGO Simpsons for Wallace's head and the rules of LEGO Ideas forbid the use of any non-existent pieces. That said, I think it would be amazing if LEGO themselves produced a set. It could also be another great way to raise money for the Grand Appeal if they were willing to donate a percentage of the profits made on each set sold. Personally, I've always been torn between trying my hand at creating a scene build of the living room from the wrong trousers, complete with the model train set from the final chase, or recreating the iconic bright orange rocket our heroes use to travel to the moon in a grand day out. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below, and as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Laters.